Okay, so this right here is Instapot's 10-in-1 Ultra Instapot Cooker. Uh, so it's a six quart um, device. And what it means by 10-in-1 is this is not just a pressure cooker, but it's also a rice cooker. You can make yogurt, you can steam foods, you can do sauteed, you can make um, baked goods like cake or even, uh, my brother just made a cheesecake this last week in his Instapot. So you can do a whole bunch of different things all in this easy to use countertop unit. Uh, so it does come with a little plug that you would plug in so you don't need to actually put like our old pressure cooker you have to, had to cook it on the stove and you have to be monitoring the heat and temperature this does all of that for you so it just makes everything so much easier and safer now to open it up you would just turn this and lift open and then when you want to close it it locks into place now when it's in operation do not touch any of the metal areas they can get really hot you don't want to um, burn yourself so what you want to do is only grab from these handles or the handle up here also never put um, anything over this little um, release valve this is where the steam comes out releasing the pressure and the steam so always grab from the front and not like from the back of your device now when you open it up the inside pot is removable um, just be aware this gets really hot when it's cooking. Now, uh, some of the things to be aware of when you are cooking with your Instapot is when this right here is up, it means this is pressurized when this is up. So if you want to release the pressure, you'd push it down. This would then allow that steam to go out. And so it can like um, cool down the pressure cooking setting a lot faster. Because if you naturally let it cool down and release pressure, it can take 10 to 40 minutes, if not longer. Um, but if you want to quick release it, then you just push that button down and it'll only take a few moments uh, to do that. Just make sure that nothing is over where the steam is released because you don't want um, to get hurt. Uh, it does come with a little, little rack right here. So that way, if you're putting like a little baking dish or other things, or say you're cooking like a roast inside of here, you'd put the roast on here so it's lifted slightly off the bottom of the pot and then the broth around it. When you're doing pressure cooking especially, you do need to make sure you have liquids in there. And how it works is it pressurizes this device with a certain heat and it forces the liquid through the other food ingredients, which causes it to cook faster. It also locks in more moisture, flavor, and nutrients, which is really nice. Now this can be used because it's an Instapot, not just a pressure cooker. You can use this as a slow cooker or a rice cooker. You can use it to boil eggs, to make yogurt. Like it has so many different things. So when you turn it on, you would basically turn this device and you would select um, which setting you want. Um, it has default settings. So if you're doing rice or other stuff, they'll just automatically do it. If you want to adjust the time and the temperature, you can manually put that in as well. So this pressure cooker does come with a recipe book to get you started so you can get used to just times and temperatures. It has a user manual, which also in the back has troubleshooting in case anything it goes wrong. And then it has a quick reference guide for certain temperatures and other things if you're making yogurt, if you're making, you know, doing different things in here. Uh, just to give you an example, using my Instapot on my pressure cooker setting, I was able to take a family recipe for a beef stew that we normally cook in the slow cooker for six to eight hours, and I was able to make it in 11 minutes. And I didn't have to monitor, I didn't have to check the temperature or anything, I just put everything in here, turned it on uh, to the setting and let it go, and then it was done. So it's really, really great if you're wanting to start streamlining some of your meals because you've got a busy um, schedule and you want to be able to cook things quick and easy. It's also great because you can take a lot of different devices that you have in your kitchen, like your rice cooker, your slow cooker, your pressure cooker, and now it's all in one nice convenient um, uh, one nice convenient unit so you're not having to store multiple different devices in your kitchen. Uh, love, love, love my Instapot. You can uh, use it for so many different things and it's super, super easy once you follow the instructions and know how to use it.